welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name's Annika and today I'm going to be doing another productive day in my life online school edition I don't have anything planned necessarily for today I just have more like a long list of things to get done so first I have to send the workouts to my friend we are both doing the two week shred challenge by Chloe Ting and I'm going to be filming it and uploading it soon so watch out for that one we are practically a week in it's day six so that's exciting then I have the four workouts written down that I have to do and then I have to reread two chapters in the book we're doing in school and do a little test on them just to revise the book really and then I have to do my skincare because I do a general skincare every day but today I want to do my more in-depth skincare. I'm not sure if I'm going to film that just because it's a lot of moving from here to the bathroom and I'm back and forward. So I might just leave that one out and if you would like to do a separate video on my skincare then I could. And then I just have to do some more homework. I have to do my tutor's homework and just things in general like that. Yesterday it snowed here in England and I was so excited, you don't even know I love the snow. I mean I'm half Swedish so it kind of makes sense but I hadn't seen snow being in slow, uh, snow in years and I love the snow and it settled like more than it usually does. Obviously it wasn't that much, it didn't last that long but I've got some cute Instagram pictures in it so we're just gonna plug my instagram here quickly sneaky little plug if you want to follow my instagram it's i'm annika costa and i got some cute instagram pictures in the snow yesterday and everyone was asking me weren't you freezing like yeah, that hypothermia or whatever because i was literally wearing a corset and a skirt <laughs> yeah to be honest i wasn't that cold i don't know if it's just me who doesn't get cold that easily I'm either cold if I'm ill or if I'm wet, like if I just got out of the shower or a pool or something, then I'm cold. But other than that, I'm not really cold, unless it's really windy either. Did practically fall over after taking those pictures though, and got extremely wet. Um, so that was fun. And then I was just throwing snowballs at my brother's window, and yeah. I start my lessons in 10 minutes, so I'm just going to go and log in now. I'm not going to join the lesson until probably like 3, 2 because I like to be a little bit early just to make sure I don't miss the beginning because in my first week I missed the beginning of so many of my lessons so now I log in a few minutes early just to make sure I don't miss and some of my teachers do start a bit earlier uh, if they don't have a lesson in front which doesn't really make sense. Tomorrow I'm going to soak my nails off because this is disgusting. I can't even believe I'm calling attention to them. Honestly, you're not even going to be able to see. They're so, it's not even focusing. They're so grown out and yesterday this middle one is actually coming off because when I was doing one of the workouts I went down to go in the plank and I just went down there like cracked. I nearly pulled my whole nail off. So I was like, okay, I need to get these soap off. Because I'm going to wait to get them taken off when things open again. But now I don't even know how long that's going to be until, so I've just decided to go ahead and soak them off and just see what happens, but yeah, it's, it was so painful, it was still painful. I just finished all my lessons in the morning, so it's my lunch break now. I had to write an article in English, which I haven't finished yet, so I'm going to have to finish that and hand it in later on today, and then I just had a physics test, which I just completed. I don't think I did that well but we'll have to wait and see. Now I'm about to do a workout. So I have four to do today for the Chloe Ting challenge and I'm not gonna film it on here, but if you do want to see that, I will be uploading a separate video on this in about a week or two's time. So hopefully that will be out soon. I'm sorry if the lighting is really weird. My room is facing the back, so the sun rises, but then it kind of goes over my room. I get this thing where half of my room is lit by sun and the other half isn't so it's a little bit weird so sorry for that but I'm gonna do my workout now and then I'm gonna go get something to eat and then I'm just gonna do some English homework finish that off to send it in <laughs>
So I just finished all my lessons for today and I've had two packages come in and I'm super excited. I wasn't expecting either of these to come in today. So first of all, I ordered a wildflower case. I've been wanting this wildflower case for so long and I absolutely love it. So I ordered it. We're gonna put that on my phone now. This wasn't supposed to arrive till the end of the week. So I'm really excited that this came. It's just, oh my God, like I've never had a wildflower case before, but I've always wanted one because I think they're just so pretty. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. And then, if I if this is what I think it is, let me just make sure my address is being covered. I'm pretty sure this is my new laptop because they always come with like this thing. So I've been using this laptop for the past few weeks for my schoolwork. And this is the 15 inch 2014 MacBook Pro. And that's my dad's laptop. I don't have a laptop, I don't really need a laptop. However, over this last quarantine, I've been doing lessons online and my dad needs to work from his laptop. So I've had several occasions where I've had to leave my lessons so he can work and because he needs to get stuff done. So we ordered a new one. I got, let's see, yeah, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I got the MacBook Pro 2020 13 inch. Oh my gosh. So excited. Oh my gosh. I haven't unboxed a laptop before because I've never had a laptop, obviously. So let's clear my desk to unbox this. Okay, so I'm going to unbox this now. I really hope you can hear me well. I'm sure you can. I'm so excited. Okay. It's going to be satisfying. Ignore this nail, by the way, it literally cracked in my lesson, it hurts so much, but we're going to ignore that. Oh my god. I ordered a laptop case from Etsy, but it's probably going to take at least a month to arrive because it's coming from China, but it's the cutest, most aesthetic thing. I'm going to start to set this up, exciting. We're in to the laptop. I'm just going to go ahead and download Chrome to start off with just because that will be the first thing that I do and I absolutely hate Safari, I don't even use Safari on my phone Chrome for Mac so we're going to go ahead and download Chrome just agree to that and then I'm going to start making it all aesthetic this is really taking time out of my day that I should have been studying but oh well you know, it's here now, I'm just gonna do it. paper to the screen I might take off the 2021 I'm not sure but I put it on there just because it is the beginning of 2021 
and then I changed my little icons I don't know if you can see there let me just see into it a little bit over there I changed my little icons to the teddy bear emoji just because I think that's super cute compared to the normal thing now I'm going to make a hot corner I think that's what it's called Basically where you go to a corner it takes you to something and you know that clock that everybody has on their screen I'm going to add that so I just need to quickly find how to add that to it again because I remember so I just can't remember the website name so I'm just going to check that quickly it i'm sure they will come out with a newer one that we can do or if anybody knows how to add that clock there then maybe for the newer updates on mac maybe you can send me a message and let me know how to do it so now i'm just going to go ahead and edit the touch bar if i can find it clock and menu bar practically finished setting up everything on my laptop I didn't film it all just because one my camera died and two if you want I can film a what's on my laptop once I'm like done a bit more I'm not sure yet if I'm gonna really film that but I might if like I get a few requests anyway now I'm gonna read a few chapters of this book because we've been given it as homework and then I have a test on there to on the chapters that I'm reading so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and I'm probably gonna FaceTime one of my friends in a bit because we haven't spoken in ages which is a bit you know what can we do but I really want to talk to her so we're gonna FaceTime in a bit I just texted her I just finished all four of my workouts from today and I feel so good about it. I am tired and out of breath but I'm about to go take a shower. I'm probably going to wash my hair because I have it in this braid because it looks dirty. I need to wash it. I did only wash it two days ago but it just like looks dirty so I think I'm going to wash it now. I'm just going to take a shower and then wind down. I only have one more piece of homework that I was going to do today which was my tutor's homework and I probably will still do that after I finish my shower but I've just been sat here watching YouTube for the past five minutes just to wind down and catch my breath again after working out. Okay guys, so I just got out the shower and I'm all fresh again and I'm just watching some Netflix now and then I have to go on and do my maths tutors homework but I think I'm going to end the video here just because after this, after I finish my maths tutors homework I'm going to eat with my family and then we're going to have some time watching TV and then I'll probably just go to bed I go to bed at like 7.30 to 9 which sounds so early to so many people but like I don't know, I just like going to bed early I'm always tired and then I wake up and feel more productive in the morning and I get a lot more done in the morning than I do the evening so I'm gonna end this video here if you enjoyed please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and watch some more of my videos Ooh. <laughs> and make sure to subscribe if you want to see more from me switch on that post notification bell because I don't have an upload schedule yet I'm kind of uploading whenever I feel like I want to film or whenever I have an idea to film I'm not really limiting myself to a schedule yet just because I'm not really comfortable 100% filming every week and I don't really have the time at the moment but I'm trying as hard as I can. And also make sure to leave a comment with video ideas that you want to see if you enjoy this type of video because I did get quite a bit of feedback saying that people enjoyed the vlog style video. Meet my phone a second saying that people enjoyed the vlog style video so if you want to see more of these then let me know or if you want to see more sit down type videos let me know that too in the down in the comments or dm me on instagram anyways thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time bye